We begin tonight with that breaking news, a mass shooting at an American church, a gunman opening fire during a service at the First Baptist Church in Sutherland Springs, a tiny town just southeast of San Antonio. At least 26 people were killed, including the pastor's own 14-year-old daughter. At least 20 others injured, many of them airlifted to nearby hospitals. FBI special agents now on the scene, and this just in, law enforcement officials have identified the suspect as Devin Kelly. You see him there. An entire town in shock as they learned the devastating news. This massacre is now the deadliest church shooting in America and the fourth deadliest mass shooting behind Las Vegas, Orlando, and Virginia Tech. We've just learned the president has been briefed several times while overseas in Japan, and we're also getting word about a hero neighbor who engaged the gunman and possibly helped save lives. We begin tonight with ABC's Marcus Moore on the scene just outside of the church. Tonight, a tiny Texas town, the site of a massacre, a shooting inside a Baptist church, first responders descending on the scene. We have six ambulances in route. Those ambulances racing to the First Baptist Church in Sutherland Springs, Texas. Authorities say it started at about 1120 this morning when a gunman walked in during Sunday services and opened fire on the congregation. As he exited the church to reload, a local resident grabbed his rifle and shot him. The suspect got away, but that good Samaritan wasn't far behind. The shooter of the church had taken off, fled in his vehicle, and the other gentleman came and he said we needed to pursue him, that he just shot up the church, and so that's what I did. The suspect dead. His vehicle found a county away from the church. And be with us, dear, as we learn to deal with this. Outside the church, tears and prayers as people gather awaiting word on loved ones possibly inside. No, there's no words. There's just, this happens in New York, in big cities. No one's safe. Word quickly spreading through the town of less than a thousand people. A pastor from a neighboring church arriving to help. We all know and we're all prepared right now that we're going to hear names and we're going to know every one of them. Texas Rangers securing the scene. The FBI and the ATF now investigating as authorities assess the horrifying tolls. 26 dead, including the pastor's 14 year old daughter. Late tonight, Texas Governor Greg Abbott responding to the massacre. As governor, I ask for every mom and dad at home tonight that you put your arm around your kid and give your kid a big hug and let them know how much you love them and marcus moore joins us live from outside that church marcus you reported the shooter is dead and now we're learning there's multiple crime scenes yeah, Tom, that's right. The first scene is the church itself. There's a second scene just outside. And the third scene is the car the suspect used, where tonight we're learning that investigators found several more weapons. Tom. Police combing over all those clues. All right, Marcus Moore reporting live for us from Sutherland Springs.